Nice Fox for nine. So thank you, nine foot Fox. Um, another mini review right now. Again, my I thought my computer would be here by Tuesday. It's not. God. Damn. Anyways, um, uh, <laughs> I just got out of Mary Poppins Ray Tans, and um, that's the worst accent you're gonna hear today. Probably not, but still. Um, I just got a Mary Poppins Returns, the sequel to the original Mary Poppins, which. Mary Pop the original Mary Poppins is a sh movie I did see, like, way, way back when. That isn't a movie I've really, like, rewatched for a long time. Though, I do get the gist of it, and it has sad sub effect on my life since every once in a while I'll say Super Califragilisticexpialidocious or say it into, like, Google or, like, Bing. Or something like that, um, and like they'll, they'll say like, that's quite atrocious, or some, some snarky comment, but, um, <laughs> uh, dang it, ah, there you go, uh, but yeah, so, the, the original movie, like, is not something I, I do remember all that well, I remember some things like Chim Chimini, Chim Chimini, Chim Chim Sharu, which, now I think about it, I do actually say that a couple of times. Or, uh, again, Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious, uh, Spoonful of Sugar. Like, the songs and everything are probably more I remember than the actual kind of story of it all. But this is Mary Poppins Returns, where it takes place 20, 30 years after the original. I th 30 years, I think, after the original. I want to say... Where the kid... Where the uh, Banks kids have grown up. Oh... Uh, Oh, uh, and, um, the, the son has his kids of his own, as well as, um, a wife who passed away, and the thing is, like, I don't know why whenever, like, they do a sequel or a return of whatever, they always go with the angle of bank, bank money, our house, like, their house is gonna be repossessed because they took out a loan, and, like, literally there's a bunch of stuff they're talking about, just, like, loans and stuff like that in the beginning, I'm like... No kid is going to give a shit about this. <laughs> but, uh, and so basically, of course, um, this guy, uh, the, the Banks family's life is kind of going down the toilet. And of course, then Mary Poppins comes in, um, followed by the new chimney sweep, who apparently was, I guess, supposed to be like a young kid in the original one. And now he's played by the guy who did Hamilton, because I keep hearing his singing. I'm like, that's the dude from Hamilton, isn't it? <laughs> I don't write, I don't know his face, but I know his singing. I know his voice. But um But yeah, so those two get uh and basically the Mary Poppins is take Mary Poppins knows exactly what to do. I think Mary Poppins is a time lord. I just want to say that right now. I'm pretty sure she's a time lord. <laughs> But, uh, Mary Poppins comes in, uh, take, takes the kids, basically, you know, not takes the kids, um, nannies the kids while also slowly rebuilding, like, slowly teaching them lessons, like, don't judge a book by its cover, or, um, meeting magical or talking animated animals that then try to kill the children. Or, at one point, even, at one point, like, Emily Blunt could literally play a live a action Elizabeth from Bioshock. <laughs> because I there's one scene where she's dancing in like the cartoon world and like she changes outfits because she changes outfits like three or four times throughout this entire movie and like hairstyles and everything. But she changes and like her hair looked exactly like Emily's Emily uh not Emily Elizabeth where it's like the kind of cut here and then long here and stuff like that. She's like she she looks like Elizabeth. I'm like Wow, I could really see her playing a live action Bioshock. Um, but, uh, yeah, like there was that bit that was kind of cool. Uh, the animation's good, even though it was, I don't know, the animation looked kind of wonky to me. I don't know, maybe it's just because I haven't seen, like, Disney animation in so long, like, movie quality Disney animation for so long. It's just like, it looks kind of off to me a little bit. I don't know why. I don't know why it does, but it looked a little off, but that's beside the point. Maybe it's just because I was watching it. We were watching it in Adobe, and, like, the screen on there is freaking great. But, um, yeah, I don't know. It just didn't feel like like a classic Disney-ish kind of animation, which I guess, yeah, it's not classic because it's new, but yeah, I hope you kind of get what I mean. But, um, 
Yeah, the movie is fun. The music, the music scores are freaking good, and Mary Poppins is fun. Like this movie is like a whole bunch of like she shows says, all of this is nonsense. <laughs> oh, this is nonsense, and you know, just have fun with it. You don't need to explain this stuff. We're just having fun, basically, and slowly teaching you guys lessons. Even though there are some points where I'm like, by God, this could be a horror film. We're like, oh, like the what is it? The two kids from the first movie. Well, technically, whatever. The kids from the first movie, they're like. Did all that stuff with Mary Poppins actually happen? And they're like, I don't think so. And in the background, Mary Poppins is sliding up the banister. And I'm just thinking, by God, you, like, oh, there's a lot of scenes in this movie where you could like, take, like, certain scenes where, like, Mary Poppins is just suddenly floating up the stairs. Or uh, Mary Poppins descending from the sky. And, um, or, like, the scene where, like, you see, like, in the trailer where it's, like, the chimney sweepers all, like, um, hanging on the lamppost in the dark. And you can add horror music over a lot of these scenes, and it would match up very well. Because it's like, wow, in any other movie, that would be a horror scene. Like, the someone person just floating up behind him, like, um. <laughs> but, uh. But, yeah, this. This was a very fun movie, though. This was a fun movie. There were one of those scenes where it's just like my brain's just messed up to the point where I'm just like, yeah, that could be looked at as a horror film kind of scene right there. But, um... But either way, it is still a fun, fun movie. It is a fun movie. It is just like... And at one point, there are some, like, CG moments where it's like, okay, that kind of does look like an old... That does kind of look like...